Welcome back. If you're new, please hit that subscribe button and the bell for notifications. It is September the 19th, 2019, and it's been 49 weeks since we got started with the African Nightcrawlers, and 29 weeks since they've been in the Vermi Bag Mammoth. A lot of nines today. A lot of nines. Alright, like usual, we're going to start off with the coffee ground side. No worms on the bubble wrap. Oh, there is a tiny, tiny, tiny one. I don't even know if it'll focus that good. I mean, that one can't be but a few days old. Little bitty dude. Hmm. All right. Let's see. Yeah, there's a few on the bubble wrap here. Decent size. Couple of decent size ones. And quite a few on top of the cardboard. Some castings. That's definitely not coffee. That is castings. Let's see what we got. Let's see if they. Oh yeah. That looks like they're liking the coffee. Might have liked that red can more than they like the blue can for some reason. Because I'm seeing. Seeing a few worms. I don't want to dig around too much, move the coffee around. Just want to kind of see what we got going on here. Yeah, I'll go ahead and flop that one down. Yeah, looks like they were just hanging out over here. I don't see too many more. Alright, so we got a few over here in the coffee side. Nothing too amazing. Go ahead and find my zipper here. Move that over. Let's see if we got any. Nope, none on that. All right, we got us a sprout. I'm gonna say that's probably a cucumber. And pick that. All right. Well, we had our banana peels over here. And no worms on it. That's interesting. And if I remember right, we had three big cucumbers right here in the middle. Some potato peels over here on the side. And an onion right here. So all I see, well, there's a worm coming, actually going back into the onion. Some red mites right on top. A few pot worms on the side. I'll have to dig in this. There's another banana peel. There's a African. Oh yeah, there we go. There's the cucumber. That's all that's left is the shell, some seeds, a few worms, and that one. Let's see what else we got. Oh, there we go. Here's the corn cob. Got a few worms in it. And we got some worms inside this cucumber. There we go. Check that out. So they're eating all the mush of the cucumber, but them seeds are still intact. Still got the skin. And then there's a bunch of red mites. Looks 
so they definitely like the inside of that cucumber should have one more and it looks about the same we got a bunch of worms inside of that one quite a few so the bad cucumber was a hit they're eating them up a lot of people say that the worms don't actually eat the food that they eat the microbes but I'm not a hundred percent convinced that's true there's a worm inside that corn cob another couple inside that one Let's see what we got underneath there's the potato peels and that's mainly just the skins looks like most of the meat's gone off of those not, there was, not that there was a lot to begin with kinda dig down a little bit and see how many worms we got underneath the food and yeah, there's a few Oh, that's the onion there. So that's about it. I'll have to feed again. I'm just going to go ahead and bury all this stuff back. Bury these cucumbers. Cover them back up. Still got plenty of coffee on the other side, but we probably need some food over here. Let me see what I got. Had a couple stalks of celery and some asparagus the ends of the asparagus and some red potato peels a little variety for them. I'm going to sprinkle it with some crushed oyster shell for grit and calcium still got plenty of coffee grounds over there so I'm not too worried about that side there's quite a bit a whole can full a 24 ounce can I believe it was so just gonna cover this up with some more shredded paper and I'll check that tomorrow for some moisture see if it soaked up any moisture or not maybe spray it down all we got today just a quick little update thank you for watching please hit that thumbs up leave me a comment until next time have a great day